In today's video, let's look at how we can combine the text in a column into a single cell. And to do that, we'll be using uh, a loop, a, a for loop, as well as um, some basic string functions to combine uh, the text. So uh, let me set this up. I have some text in uh, column A, uh, and it spells out this is a sentence. And so I want to combine this into uh, a single sentence uh, and put it all in cell B1. Okay, so let's get to the code. So uh, I've got a sub concatenate here and let's get some declarations out of the way. So I'll define my workbook dim wb as workbook and set wb equals to this workbook. Next. Let me get the worksheet. So dmws as uh, worksheet, then set ws to uh, workbook dot sheets, then sheet one. I also want to declare a uh, string variable. Let's call it sentence. Uh, this will hold the uh, sentence that we combine. Uh, in sentence as a string. Okay, so um, let's look at the column again. So to keep things simple, I, in this case, it's a definite um, endpoint at uh, row 4. But if, uh, you know, you need to get the uh, the last row and that, that varies, uh, you could look at my other video on how to find the last row of a column. So let's do this. So let's do the loop for i equals to 1 to 4. And then we'll close that out. Next i. Uh, what do we want to do? We want to... So our sentence, uh, spelling mistake sentence, will be equals to sentence itself. And ws.cells uh, i sorry yeah i1 is that correct will be sentence equals to the sentence and yeah the row number i column one okay and then so once that's done we want to set the value of cell b2 to sorry cell b1 to sentence so ws dot cells Uh, row 1, column 2 will be equals to sentence. Okay, so now we have our code here. If uh, everything works correctly, what should happen is uh, this is a sentence in one line should appear here. So let's give it a go. Let's run. And uh, here you can see that it, it concatenates, but then there is a um, no space in between the, the the separate cells. So what we should do is we can add a space, and then and okay. So now let's run it again, and we should have a good-looking sentence here. Uh, you do notice that there's a gap here. So what we could then do, if you want to remove any uh, uh, space in at the start or end of the sentence, you could then do it like this, trim, then wrap it around your sentence. So if you run this now, and then we look at the sentence here, we see that there's no space. Okay guys, hope you found this useful. Um, I mean, I use this quite often when I have uh, like timestamp uh, data and I want to combine the sentences from say a video output into one single cell. Uh, that's when I use this. Uh, hope you found this useful and uh, if you have any questions, please let me know.